Let's do that thump. That's Jack Cameron thump. Yeah, anyways. Welcome to the show, guys. This is Connor from Out of Work. We are on the Oklahoma Kayak Anglers Tour. This is the premier tour kayak series, I guess you would say, of Oklahoma. It goes all the state. To all my new viewers, uh, please subscribe to the channel because that's what we do. We just do fishing, all types, kayaks fishing, striper fishing, hybrid fishing, bass tournaments, boats, kayaks, all of the above, basically. But anyways, uh, this is the central opener. Uh, we have a check-in spot and we fish a 35 mile radius. Any body of water you want. And uh, I got to the boat right below late. My flight wasn't working, so I waited for safe flight. But here's my first bite. There we go. There we go. That's a good one. That's a prank bass. That's why we come here. That's why we come here. That's why. That's why we come here. That's why. That's why we come here. That's why we come here. That is why we come here. Look at that. Look at that, boys. Oh, that's the bigs. Oh, that's the bigs. That's the bigs. That's the bigs. That's Mr. Biggs. All right, Mr. Biggs. All right, Mr. Biggs. Mr. Biggs. Mr. Biggs. There you go. You don't see those guys every day. 22. Mr. Biggs. Oh, well, that's 22, alright. It's a Biggs. It's a Biggs. It's a Biggs. Come on, bro. We'll see. Oh, I white jackhammer up. Yeah. But it was right, right before the sun came up, though. I haven't got a bite since. So I'm trying to figure something out. This morning, Josh Barlow, and my brother, they were all throwing, like, hot water. Yeah. Did he? That's good to know. At least there's activity over here. Here we go. Come on. It's a small one. It's not big, but it'll do. Sixteen and a quarter. Here you.
What do you mean? Oh, I got one. Yep. Now you're like my good luck charm. Oh, that's a good one. All right. You're the fish whisperer. <laughs> Chatterbait. At least today, or at least right now, it's a chatterbait. Uh, maybe a 17. Guys, Say 18. All right, we got four fish. We're on the struggle bus. Uh, the places I was fishing feels like they dried up, so we gotta go find some new spots. A little bunch of guys were fishing in this area. They were on their way back, and they were all telling me they probably were going in the day. We knew in the morning, but they haven't caught anything since. So. I was like, I guess I'll go off for some sloppy seconds. Make my way up there. Throw the jackhammer again. Back to the white. So, I alternate back and forth between the white jackhammer and the green pumpkin cross eye. Cross eye chatter. Uh, uh, they have their both pros and cons, but, uh, you know, I catch a fifth one here. Come on, baby. Come on, buddy. Oh, came off. Oh no, we got one. We got one. That's the limit fish, guys. So happy to see a 12 incher. Ah, that's the limit fish. Caught ourselves a limit. We got ourselves a limit fish. Ah, it's a little one. I ain't, I ain't even mad. I'm just super happy at the moment. <sighs> Caught ourselves a limit. Caught ourselves a limit fish. Pretty cool, right? Catching everything on the jackhammers today. Well, I have two on jackhammer, two, three on something else. Twelve and a half. Twelve and a half. Thank you. 
12. A 12. That's a decent one. That's a decent one. That's a decent one. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, sir. That's bigger than 15, boys. That's bigger than 15. How'd you, how'd you get out? Anyhow, that's bigger than 15. Whew, that's like another 17, 16. Whew. All right, homies. That's the one we need. That's the one we need. No. 16, sir. Alright, a uh, 17. 17. Alright, so here's the standings. If everything doesn't get DQ, I will be sitting in fifth place with 91 and a half. It's a pretty impressive tournament with 91 and a half does not get you top three. Uh, it's because Mike caught a freaking 23 and a half. Danny got a whole bunch of nice ones. 20s, 18 and a half. Yep. Mike's got a little one though, but that 23 and a half is, whoo, that anchor, that, that got anchored too good. And then Mr. James Vu, 22, 20, 17, and 16. That's pretty impressive. That is pretty impressive. Pretty impressive, guys. Pretty impressive. Alright, we got into the top five, so that's pretty good, pretty good, uh, a little disappointed because we did miss a couple key fish, I had two bites that were, I think were big fish, like over 20, and I needed another 20 really bad, because if I did, I think I could have been in the winner's circle, I mean, the winner, but how'd you do, huh? 88 inches, lost a big one. 88 inches, lost a big one, if you caught that big one, money. you think you would have been in the money? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. So. I got 88, I would have called my little 15 for maybe a 19 or 20. Yep. Today was pretty crazy. We had like uh, thunderstorms roll in and then what, around 10 o'clock started blue bird skies. Mm -hmm. So you had to make a lot of adjustments. I started off with a chatterbait and then started throwing a popper and then I started throwing a wake bait and I threw a, uh, a brush hog. Got a big bite by a brush hog up shallow too, just fishing grass. I don't know what happened. It tugged, I tugged, nothing. I uh, had a wake bait bite that was like huge. I don't know why I didn't hook up. So that's that's my day. That's my story. We'll see how we do. This is only uh, day one. We're going to have a day two tomorrow too. You go fish day two? On a flooded lake. High water flooded lake. It's going to be a flipping bite. You know, we don't do flipping very much. So we'll see how that goes.